Whether you're looking for a staycation or a fun night on the town, we checked out two new hotels in the heart of Philadelphia in Center City. One gives you a taste of luxury with an upscale vibe. The other is like taking a quaint trip back in time to the 18th century. Take a look. The W Philadelphia, part of the Marriott Hotels at 15th and Chestnut Streets, was designed to be like a love letter to the city. Starting with the mural arts that we have, you know, kind of representing all of the public art throughout the city. And then um, the parks of the city, um, the columns that you see here are kind of meant to resemble the trees in the parks and the lights are the stars at night. The 51 story skyscraper hotel has around 300 guest rooms, including 40 suites, all with different themes. Other amenities include the away spa, fitness center and two dining and bar area. My favorite part though, there's a little hidden room, a little secret room here. Sure, so every W Hotel has what we refer to as a secret space. And here our secret space is a room called Stephen's Prophecy, which is behind the bar and uh, features a wonderful lounge area. And uh, you know, it's a great place to have a little secret rendezvous. On the seventh floor, you're transported to the secret garden and wet deck pool bar. Risa Mueller is the cocktail curator and created all of the hotel's drink menus. This one is called the Red Flags uh, because the more you have, the more attractive you are. <laughs> this is like our baller party drink. Reposado tequila, um, a little bit of an aperitif, uh, passion fruit, vanilla, citrus, and then it's topped off with um, Red Bull Yellow Edition. So this one will definitely help you keep the party going. Step back in time at the Guildhouse Hotel on 13th and Locust. This unique boutique stay offers 12 guest rooms that all pay homage to Philadelphia's former New Century Guild. The New Century Guild was founded in 1882 and it was an organization that was formed to enable and provide education for women as they were entering the workforce for the very first time. We wanted to honor the history and the women who gathered here, but it was really important to us that we didn't create a museum. Each room is named after one of the guild's original members, like this room, inspired by the organization's founder, Eliza Turner. It's a junior suite. It was formerly the library, which is why you'll find all of the beautiful, ornate woodwork um, that was here. The the hotel also offers contactless check-ins and a lounge area, complete with real historical artifacts. Um, vintage votes for women, teacups that our designer um, procured. This site was actually home to the first organized Philadelphia women's suffrage. In fact, um, so many of the books here were actually in the library that we were visiting earlier, the Eliza Suite. This isn't only sort of honoring history, it's, it's a it's a part of history. That's right. When you step in here, you're now a part of it too. That's right. Wow, so cool. If you want to book a stay or enjoy a night in the city at the W Philadelphia or the Guildhouse Hotel, we've got information for you in the Philly Live section of NBC10.com and the NBC10 app.